wonder how much further it is until we get there. Not that I'm bored or anything, but it would be nice to start some digging. Maybe I'll dig up something new and surprising. Oh, what was that? It looked like... Oh, but it couldn't be. Because it's really not possible. Oh, I must be seeing things. I don't want to be seeing things. The best way to stop yourself seeing things is to shut your eyes. Then you can't see anything. Ow! Dude, what was that? It's that steam shovel, Mr. Oliver. Miss Marion! Sorry! Sorry, Oliver! I'm so sorry! I had my eyes closed. I just didn't want any more nasty surprises. Oh! It's only Mike. <laughs> huh? Oh, and Rich, too. What? And Bert. Oh! Haven't you ever seen a miniature engine before, Marion? Well, I've seen small engines, but those engines are very small. Very, very small. Very, very... Fa are they real? Real? Of course we're real. We bring all the ballast to put onto your track. And pull for making clothes. And passengers, too. <laughs> what magical little engines. <gasps> That's it. Magic. They must be. I bet they make wishes come true. Rex, Bert and Mike were busy bringing all the ballast that would be needed for the new branch line. <laughs> Hello down there. Hello up there. Hello down there and up there. <laughs> Hello. What's this? Oh dear, Thomas. What's up with you? Sir Topham Hatt has taken my branch line away and given it to some other tank engine called Ryan. What? Why would he do that? Because of Gordon, the big bossy boiler, that's why. He called me a silly little tank engine and made me cross. Oh, big engines always think they're better than small engines. That's right. They look down on us, <laughs> even when we're the ones on top. Exactly. Never overlook a little engine. Little ones are really useful too. We got trucks to pull, so make them extra full. I've never known a job that I couldn't do. With a bit of help from me, maybe. Never overlook a little engine. We could take you where you want to go. We may have tiny track, but we'll get you there and back. And hold on to your hats, we don't go slow. Look out, Thomas! If you think the baker's better, then you're making a mistake. The ocean isn't wetter than a tiny little lake. A cherry might be tastier than a great big cake. And we can turn around in half the time those big guys take. Never overlook a little engine. We have set our sights upon the sky. You need a lot of puff. Being big is not enough. I've never known a job that I wouldn't try. <laughs> I Me mean, neither. Nor me. Never overlook a little engine Like me Like me Like me Like us <laughs> <laughs> OK, Thomas, off you go. They might not be ready for the ballast yet, though. They need to lay down the new rails first. Right, I've got it. Rails first, ballast after. Rails first, bows after. Rails first, bows after. Rails first, The very small engines, Rex, Bert and Mike, were all at Aldsborough Junction when Marion arrived. Magic engines! Oh no, not her again. Magic engines! Is she talking about us? <laughs> 
I expect she's talking about Mike. Me? Why me? Just because. Oh, well, <laughs> I'm not waiting around to find out either. I want to make a wish, Magic Engines. Please. Oh, oh, oh what, what are you doing? Wait! Let me make one wish. Just one! Make, make a wish? But let go! Oh. Stop pushing! <laughs> All I want is one wish. Please! Oh, I... You gave Oliver a wish. Little magic engine, please can I be the one to dig up the buried treasure? Oh. <laughs> I did it! I made my wish! And he disappears in a puff of smoke <gasps> by magic! By the time Thomas arrived at Aldsborough Junction, <coughs> he was coughing and spluttering. <coughs> oh dear, Thomas. You don't sound right. I know. That Ryan, he makes my firebox fume. Um, I don't think Ryan can make sparks come out of your funnel. <coughs> I think you've had some bad coal. <laughs> and you don't want bad coal, Thomas? That won't make you really useful. Oh. Pirates! Pirates? That sounds like Thomas. Stop! Stop that ship! That's my bird! What? Those little engines? Quick, give us a push! Never overlook a little engine! That's right! Go get him, Thomas! <laughs>